say, get ready for a glimpse of the future. But that wouldn't be right. The future is already here. the next objective. One of the cars the Motorfest wants to showcase for our lovely reviewer Danny is the Porsche Taycan Turbo S. An engineering marvel with all the slick style of the Porsche and the raw power of battery-powered acceleration. Remember, drive the vehicle to the designated location while keeping it as unblemished as possible. It's a showcase after all. for me. You make it look so easy. Writing about these beasts is no easy feat, and I'm not much of a driver. I'm lucky to be teaming up with you. Anyway, let's do this. I might not drive, but I know quite a lot about these machines. The Porsche Taycan Turbo S? Where do I start? The first 100% electric vehicle made by the Stuttgart manufacturer. Different variations available on the market. The Turbo S you're driving being the high performance model. Hey, nice! We got the best one! If I remember correctly, it can reach 100 kilometers per hour in, wait, let me check my notes, 2.8 seconds. Wow, you think you could try that? I mean, without damaging the car, obviously.
these sculptures are just wow. Feels like we're on an island-sized exhibition. I gotta snap some shots. Great job. I got some great pictures for my paper. Now the race really begins! that it'd be great to have shots in a storm, but damn, Hawaii, you didn't have to go so hard. Anyway, I'm eager to see how great the Tykin's grace. It'll spice up my review for sure. lively young horse in Turkish. That's cool, but to me, Porsche is being modest here. I mean, look at that thing go!
nitro lanes to refill your nitro batteries. Don't make fun of me, but to me, EVs like that Porsche is like a new power joining the car universe. Like a friggin' superhero. What? I mean it. Clear shot. Full power. Let's make history. I can't believe I'm being a part of this. This is mental. You did it.
online. I'm ready to do this. Let's get out of town first. I'm so glad the Avaya's got included in this EV lineup. I barely got to check it out when it first came out. But this time, I'll make sure to review the sh living daylights out of it. For starters, did you know they only made 130 of them? Oh my god, the paint. The Avaya has been called many things. Eve, Type 130, Omega, but most people call it fast. I mean it. They can reach a max speed of 340 kilometers per hour in like nine seconds. That's just insane. That speedway is a perfect place to check that fact. Let's see how fast she can really go. Right? It's like the stealthiest show of force. Check the wind turbines on the left. Looks like the wind is picking up. We're here. Good luck for the race. And don't forget, use the Lotus's full acceleration from the start. From zero to a hundred. Combustion engines just can't compete. driving at warp speed through a tempest and racing a bunch of friggin' monsters. What could go wrong? Keep her as steady as you can. I'm gonna try to get good footage. That EV has a pyramid-shaped battery and an extremely low center of gravity. Slick engineering innovation for an optimal combo of power, responsiveness, and agility. It's gonna give you the edge, no matter what you're racing against. Trust me. You are actually part of the storm. You're lightning. I should write that down. horsepower with that kind of acceleration? No wonder Eve isn't street legal. Almost there. Gotta get those glory shots. 
This car was made for the spotlight. Victory! You rode the lightning, and I got the shots of a lifetime. showcasing will likely surprise you. Danny is beside himself with excitement. Think of it like a revival. I'm sure you've never written anything like this before. Your vehicle for the next race and showcase will be the GMC Hummer EV. This rough rider can buy size and speed like never before. Give it a whirl. Oh, and it might be sturdy, but remember to keep it pristine for the delivery. Have fun! Can you hear me? Okay, good. Wow, this one is gonna be a trip. I'm super excited. It's been over 10 years since the GMC released a Hummer. Let's see what this electric behemoth has in its belly. driving zero to 100 in four seconds <laughs> that is pretty fast for something that heavy that road without looking? That's bold. Perfect traction from shallow water to land. I'm actually looking for a title for my review. Well, what about the uh, E bear? No? Your silence speaks volumes. All right, we'll find something else. Do you think you could really go for it in this next set of turns? I want to see how the suspension holds up. This car 
is like halfway between a tank and a cloud. Wish that slope was even steeper. I'd love to see what those three electric engines can do. Almost there. I still need a title, by the way. The Graceful Giant, maybe? Okay, never mind. We'll figure it out after the race. Like this is where the fun starts. You're racing a power truck smack in the middle of a volcano, surrounded by, um, I mean, look at all this. The suspension definitely works. The Hummer, the power, the talent, you get all the ingredients we need to win this thing. is so much fun. I can't believe they actually made this thing. Whoa, this place looks like some kind of trippy moon. How am I supposed to describe this? Oh, forget it. Look at this. Nobody's gonna believe me anyway.
just look at those 250 kilowatt engines at work. This rules. Job, but the journey is far from over. You did it! You delivered our three cars and proved EVs can more than hold their own against the greatest gas guzzlers. Danny's ecstatic. Thanks for making this happen. when it comes to the EV Odyssey. Dragon ID buggy concept? <laughs> that car isn't even in production. You're driving an actual concept car. I have no idea what's coming next, but it's off to a great start. Wow, wow, whoa, you're not gonna... I mean, come on! Stopped beating for a moment. We're back with the Porsche Taycan. Perfect. My audience loves when I write about the Taycan. Among the street e-cars, it's kind of an obvious choice.
This is a three-phase race, right? I wonder what car Motofest picked up for the final heat. No way. They are actually giving us a Lamborghini Terzo Millenio? This bizarre concept car was a glimpse of what the future of Lambo could be. A hyper Lamborghini, pushing the full standards to the extreme. An electric monster, pure and simple. Clear skies ahead. Perfect time to punch it. Straight away, that's your cue. Terso Millennio, allá vamos! That was amazing! I freaking love EVs. You just proved that the lightning is here to stay. Make sure to get your vehicle reward driver. The storm has passed, but the EV lightning strike will remain forever. Danny's headed back already. He couldn't wait to use all that data he gathered. Back to business. Our last stop, the container. One of the star vehicles is waiting for you there. Let's give the new playlist a spin.